Hey there, everybody. Scudder here. Hope you guys are doing great. Man, it has been a while, hadn't it? It has been a while since I've done a video. Uh, lots of reasons for that. So this is going to be just kind of a catch-up video, uh, just to touch base with everybody and see how everybody's doing and let you know what's been going on with me. I uh, hope you guys have been having a fun holiday for those of you that celebrate the Christmas and Hanukkah holiday. Uh, I have been super busy, so had lots of holiday stuff going on. Uh, I was sick for about two weeks. Uh, I got a really bad uh, flu bug, and so I was pretty sick there for um, a few weeks, and I'm still trying to get over it. So uh, that's been kind of rough. I don't know whatever kind of flu is going around this year. Man, it's been it's been sucky it, it's been bad and a lot of people around here have had it too so I know it's it's just been a really bad flu season I guess uh, but I am feeling a little bit better so uh, and I was right in the middle of the angel card project and you guys know uh, that know me know that when that's going on things are very 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 crazy for me during that time so um, but I'd like to say that the Angel Card Project so far has been a pretty good success. Um, we had 289 names submitted this year uh, that were put on the list, and we had 800 and about 860 volunteers, um, which is pretty good, I would say, in this economy. So uh, that's been great, and. We're just now wrapping that up. I don't have a total yet on how many cards went out, um, but I, I usually wait until after Christmas to make sure everybody gets their totals into me. So when um, I get that, then I'll, in another video after Christmas, I'll let you guys know how many cards went out this year. Uh, it's always fun to kind of wait and see how many actual cards go out. So anyway, uh, and on that note, I wanted to say, for those of you who um, helped me uh, during the Angel Card Project, for those of you that signed up to volunteer to send cards, thank you. I appreciate that very, very much. And I know that the people who have been receiving the cards have been uh, really appreciating that. I've already gotten um, some emails and have, um, have been hearing some stories on the people who have receiving cards and how much it has blessed them this year. And it's also, uh, I got a email from a lady who sent cards and she told me that she was sending the cards and she's taking care of her elderly mother and her mother is in the beginning stages of dementia and uh, or Alzheimer's I can't remember which but anyway and she said that her mother wanted to do some cards and she said that they sat down and had the best time just making the Christmas cards out for the Angel Card Project. And she she knows that this is probably going to be um, the last year that her mother will be able to do that um, with her mind. And she said that it was such a wonderful blessing to her and her family to be able to share that with her mother this year. So see, there's a lot of good stuff that happens with the Angel Card Project. Um, I wanted to also thank you guys, those of you with YouTube channels who helped me promote the angel card project um, thank you very much for doing that it did help quite a bit and I appreciate that I have to say um, kind of on a negative note um, I contacted quite a few people um, that I know through YouTube and asked them to just run a quick blurb in one of their videos about the angel card project and uh, there were several uh, people who I uh, really kind of respected who didn't even bother returning my message uh, to say no thanks man can't do it this year don't have time not my thing uh, just no word at all uh, one person in particular who actually I thought I was friends with uh, didn't even bother sending me a rejection note uh, so I was pretty disappointed uh, in some people this year uh, you know and it's just a common courtesy you know just for future reference uh, you know, if someone asks you to do something and you're just not able to do it, at least have the respect and decency to send them a message back and just, you know, politely decline. Um, not sending anything at all, uh, I feel like is rather rude, and uh, it kind of shows a lack of character. So, just something for future reference. 
Uh, anyway, other things, um, I'm wrapping up Christmas stuff with all my groups. Uh, things have been very busy there. And uh, I was going to go to Montana for Christmas this year. And I'm not going to be able to go uh, because the travel rates, oh my God, they were just enormous. Uh, even for a train, it was going to cost me almost $1,000 just to go by train to Montana. So didn't get to go spend Christmas with mom this year. Um, that kind of sucks because I really had wanted to see mom for Christmas. But, you know, it is what it is. So maybe next year. Um... Haven't been watching much news uh, with it being Christmas and me having so much charity stuff uh, going on. I try to stay away from the news during this time um, as much as I can uh, because I don't want to be bummed out. Um, I know lots of lots of stuff's going on, lots of stuff's happening, lots of bad stuff. Uh, but I had to make myself stay away from it for a while uh, while I've been doing all this other stuff uh, just so I wouldn't get bummed out. Um, I've been trying to kind of keep an eye on... Uh, the metals prices and what's going on with the metals markets and all that surrounded with that. Um, but other than that, I've just kind of steered away from the news. But, you know, after the holidays, I'm sure I'll get back and, and uh, we'll be a little more interested in what's going on with all that. Uh, I don't know. There's not much else going on. Uh, I've just been super busy. I've uh, been busy with business stuff uh, since it's the holiday season and I'm in sales. Then, you know, this is my time of year. And so I've been busy with that and haven't had a chance to uh, talk to many people. That's why I haven't been making videos is because I've been so busy. So, But I hope that you guys have been having a great holiday season. And I want to wish you guys a Merry Christmas uh, for those of you that do celebrate Christmas. And hope that you get to spend time with the people that you care about and love. And if you are able to do that, please do that because it is very important and uh, you know, we never know what tomorrow is going to bring. So you need to spend the time with the people that you care about and that you love and that are closest to you uh, while you have the opportunity to do that. So anyway, I'm going to wrap this up because it's boring and it's going to get long. And anyway, Merry Christmas to you guys. And I shall be back hopefully soon uh, after the holidays with some more fun and exciting stuff. And we'll get the channel revved back up again. Um, I'm going to go out of town for myself, I'm probably just going to take a break. Um, probably, I'm going to say sometime between now and New Year's, or maybe right after New Year's, uh, I'm going to get away uh, just for a few days by myself. I get I do so much during the year, especially on the computer, that I get burnout, and I am in burnout mode right now. So i got to get away for a few days um, just to clear my head and get some sleep and take a break and do something other than be on the computer all the time so uh, but other than that uh, hopefully I'll be back soon to share more stuff with you guys and I've got some Bible stuff that I want to get started um, but I needed to wait until after all this holiday stuff was over with so that I could concentrate on it uh, and bring it uh, with a clear head to you guys but I would like to start doing some more of that on my channel um, and, you know, it's just news and other junk, stuff like that. So, anyway, all right, I'm rambling. I'm just rambling. Merry Christmas to you guys. Love you all. And thank you for your friendship and for your time. I appreciate it very, very much. And we shall talk to you soon. God bless you.